trails are gone. There'll be hell finding a way out. Do you think a retreating army and their dominant will fare any better? Titan has knocked the fight out of our iron blood friends. Where are the rest of them? That can't be the main host. Wait. King Pat! Bitra! Our fortunes have turned, Sergeant. It's her. The dominant? Are you certain? The crystalline orthodox is a backwards faith for a backwards people. In the Iron Kingdom, they teach that dominants are unclean aberrations born of blackest sin. Only their priests are allowed to perform the rites of priming. And I see many. We end this quickly. Shrinkskart! Adionir Sagarid! Drach! Now, King Alad Scully asked.
Is she dead? I don't think so. Well? What are you waiting for? Bloody do it then! so we can be done with this. I... I can't. I won't. You would betray the Holy Empire? Betray? I don't recall ever pledging allegiance to your Emperor. My service may have been bought with this brand, but not my loyalty. I just fight to survive. And you think I don't? The Empire will have our heads if we return empty handed. So if you won't take hers, I'll have to take yours. I told you, Sergeant. I'm not dying here today. And neither is she. Let's find out. <laughs> from the front lines, who trained you, you were nothing, no one, and I will not fall by your hand! <laughs> Traitor's blade.
this way. Bloody wind. Well, come on then. Fuck. Fuck. Hugo dear, my proud desert lion. Would that you had taken care when chasing the hare. I expected more from the mighty Titan. You put the Ice Queen on her back, no doubt. But you'll have to work harder if you're to claim this price. My lady, the thunder. We'll be hearing more soon enough. You always were a fucking snake, Sid. Gather the men. We have work to do. Jill, is it really you? And who's this fine hound I see before me? A fine hound who saved your life, that's who. Torgal. Hey. His name is Torgal. You two acquainted? Well then, you won't mind taking him off my hands. Funny. I'd always pictured you as more of the chocobo type. Clive Rosfield. Come now. Fleet as flame, fierce as a wildfire. That there was the blessing of the Phoenix. I'd heard rumors that you'd survived, but I never paid them much heed. <laughs> Calm down. I didn't come all this way for your handsome mug. Now her, on the other hand, she seemed worth muddying my boots for. for wear. Still, might be best to get a second opinion. Crack her up! No. Oh. Not another step. <laughs> I mean it. Well, I'm not about to leave her here. Not one with a warm bed waiting. It's all right. You're welcome to join us. You do want to help her, don't you? Uh, Sid, if we aren't back soon, none will have our heads. <laughs> I'll explain everything once we're back at the hideaway. Come on.
Not much further now. But we're in the middle of the Deadlands. Keen eye, you. The blight sucked this place dry. Meaning no trees, no birds, and no magic. But it also means no neighbors. The last place anyone would think to look. Home sweet home. This place. These are fallen ruins. Well, we didn't think they'd mind. And it keeps the black from our lungs. But how do you survive without magic? How does anyone? Hard work and a bit of nelf. You must be starving. We grow them here, believe it or not. Hmm? Suit yourself. You're back. Ah, it's how you. And this is the dominant. How cold since we found her. I was hoping you might give her a look over. All right. Goots, get her upstairs. Well, but none will... Don't fret about Karen. I've taken care of her fee. All of it. She's the best healer this side of the belt. You've nothing to worry about. Go on. Have a look around. I'll be in my solar. There's a good girl. Hungry, are you? Sid says we shouldn't travel alone, that the Deadlands here are unforgiving. Still, needs must. Sid says we shouldn't travel alone, that the Deadlands here are unforgiving. Still, needs must. Newcomer. 
You mind the rules round here, or our next chat will be through the bars. Uh, another newcomer. You mind the rules round here, or our next chat will be through the bars. The washroom floor's all mended then. It'll hold for now. Your brand. Lady Tyre might be able to see to that. You may have been born a slave, but you're a free man now. Your brand. Lady Tyre might be able to see to that. Leave me be. Not until you've had your medicine. These apples are all foul. Would you rather you went without? Sid once told me, the blight doesn't kill the land, it only makes her forget who she once was. She'll eventually remember her purpose. All she needs is a little reminding. Sid once told me, the blight doesn't kill the land, it only makes her forget who she once was. She'll eventually remember her purpose. All she needs is a little I suppose I'll be needing a new sword. Then you'll need to speak with Blackmore. You reckon he's a soldier, then? I'd be surprised if he wasn't. The smell of war is thick about him. If you can read, don't let Otto know. We'll put you to work on the ledgers, too. If you can read, don't let Otto know. Chasing rumours, sits up there in that hole of his, brooding and scheming. When lightning struck, his yoke did break, his life his own again. With thunder's roll, he knew his fate and would fight it to the end. Well, what do you think? I woke this morn inspired. When lightning struck his yoke, he you. Spent the whole morning on these steps. a good girl. Hungry, are you? working on a pet project of mine, though she's not above biting the hand that feeds her. All right, I was hoping we might try and solve the mystery of poor Clive Rossfield, a bearer of the San Brequois Imperial Army sent behind enemy lines, with orders to wait until it turned into a brawl, then slit the dominant's throat in the chaos. I didn't know it was her. 
How could it be? And so, to save her neck, you slit your sergeants, then set your sights on the hills, conveniently forgetting how the Empire deals with deserters. Because with that on your chop, my friend, we both know you won't be getting far. You've fallen a long way, Lord Rossfield. <sighs> I'll not have it said that I'm a poor host. What do you mean to do with her? Do with her? Why, nothing. Her life is her own now. If I wanted to use her, do you think I'd be talking to you? All I want to do is help. Dominance like her, branded like you. Of course, the realm doesn't approve, which is why we live in a cave. And it's also why we need help. From branded who know one end of a sword from the other. What say you, Clive? Will you join us? Sid, was it? I trust that you'll do right by Jill. But until my brother is avenged, I must walk my own path. Avenged. My brother was murdered by a second dominant of fire. The Phoenix is evil twin. Well, oh, bugger me. Another rumor proven true. I only stand here today because of Joshua. Thirteen years I've waited for this chance. I've slept in filth, drunk from a gutter, killed more men than I can count. You're right. The Empire will not suffer a deserter. This will be my best opportunity. My last. Which is why you should join us. I told you I'm not... Interested, I know. One of my scouts sent word there's a group of branded fugitives north of here, in the Imperial village of Lost Wing. Among them is one he believes to be a dominance of fire. Is he certain? What say we go and ask him? This doesn't mean I'm joining you. Let's make ready then. You'll find everything you need down in the main hall, as well as a few things you don't. Have fun. It's downstairs. Try not to get lost. It's downstairs. Try not to get lost. She's not disturbed. <gasps> he, he's in... Oh, no. Go towards it. Perhaps you can help. Sid asked me to make ready for our mission. How does one go about that here? Uh, well, uh, 
this old nun's place. Oh, oh, uh, on second thoughts, uh, you maybe want to see Blackthorn first. A blacksmith? To the forge it is then. Oh, wait, no, hold up. You'll be needing this. Blackthorn won't take no notice of you otherwise. Might not anyway. The forge is down the end. Just follow the sound of Blackthorn's hammer. The forge is down the end. Just follow the sound of Blackthorn. like this room here for another bloody crate. No, Lady Karen. I'm sorry, Lady Karen. What are you gulping at, newcomer? Never seen a man work with his hands? Well, you best get used to it if you're thinking of staying. What are you gulping at, newcomer? Seeing as you're new, let me share a word of warning. Keep your hands out of the stores, or I'll cut them off and crate them with the others. <laughs> I'm only teasing. We feed the hands to the dogs. <laughs> Seeing as you're new, let me share a word of warning. Keep your hands out of the stores, or I'll cut them off. It is. Found a pair of new Sid once told me the blight doesn't kill the land, it only makes her forget who she once was. She'll eventually remember her past. All she needs is a little reminding. These apples are all foul. Would you rather eat your brand? Lady Tyre might be able to see to that. Me. Not until you've had your medicine. You another one of Sid's strays? What? We all are. Little ones, big ones, and everything in between. We're a damn sight better off here than out there in the world. You another one of Sid's strays? And how did you like this too? And neither I are you. Had one fish is sweet and tender. If you can read, don't let Otto know. You think he'd have time for a nip with old August before scampering back to his solar? But no. Lonely are we, August? <laughs> when lightning struck. It's downstairs. Try not to get lost. The dominant needs her rest. Blackthorn. What if I am? I'm no time for idle chatter. I'm not here to talk. I'll be accompanying Sid to Lostwing and I need you to see to my equipment. You could be accompanying the goddess Grieger to our holy bedchamber for all I care. I'm not lifting a finger for you. Is that so?
Do you want that or not? I can take it back. Oh, damn you, Goots. All right, all right. No need to be hasty. Let's have a look at you. <laughs> I doubt that lot could stay a Moogle's fart. Bloody Imperials. They'd rather see their bearers dead than kid it out properly. I'll do what I can, as a favor to Goot's mind. Caesar Square. You want anything else? You bring your own materials. I'll bear that in mind. Thank you. <sighs> A word of advice. Don't let Sid decide what's best for you. I'm busy here. So, will it be? And how am I meant to do that then? No scratches, right? work, but it'll do. Anything needs repairing. But I ain't the cook, am I? Look. You got anything needs repairing? Off you go then. Don't want to keep Sid waiting.
the ticket bag and tell that blockhead I'm not paying for stuff I didn't ask for. The gift worked. You have my thanks. I, uh, uh, <laughs> Come on, nearly there. Blankets, quick as you like. <laughs> All right, we make them comfortable while the bed's made up. <laughs> well, you're just gonna stand there, someone fetch some water. I'll get the bucket. You go and see if I don't needs out, eh? Yeah. <laughs> Wait, me? <sighs> what the hell have I got myself into?